And I remember going into our training camp and you said, DeMarcus, I'm just trying to make the team. And I said, you just run the football and you just use the speed that you have. And guess what? You ran all the way to your first Pro Bowl. Lindsay took to Twitter to remind people that they can measure height, they can measure weight, but they cannot measure the heart of a man. And I've been proving people wrong my whole life, and I'm going to do that again going to the NFL. Speaking of TD, look who is wearing number 30 these days. Phil Lindsay had a little jersey change. Lindsay, of course, grew up watching Davis. He said the first book he ever read out of school was TD's autobiography, and now he not only plays his position, he's going to wear his number as well. So he asked for it. Yeah. So the first thing I'm like, wow, that's pretty cool. Like the dude called me for it. Okay. Because yeah, nowadays, a lot of, you know, these millennials are different, players are different. You know, they'll just go take the number and then really don't have a history or understanding about the number. And he had full knowledge of it. He's from Denver, went to see you. But then the fact that he's an underdog, he's undrafted, and I felt like that number kind of represents that. No matter, uh, you know, drafted, undrafted, it's uh, exciting. And uh, I'm, I'm happy to be a part of the team and, and uh, I'm ready to get things going. Over 200 players were drafted in the NFL draft, and yet the Broncos' leading rusher, this kid Philip Lindsay, wasn't one of them this year. He's on pace to break Dominic Rhodes' record as the most yards rushing ever by an undrafted running back. Star just from his personality uh, to his game to everything about it, man. He's a star. Uh, he's gonna be making plays around here a long time if he stays healthy, man. Cause he, he got it. He got the hit. Toss it left to Lindsey. Lindsey is loose. Here we go. 